Children improve vocabulary skills by reading to animals. A Palm Beach County student and dozens of other kids in our area are getting a boost in their schoolwork while also volunteering to improve the lives of some furry friends. The delight that comes from one particular Zoom call is complete with surprises for 10-year-old Layla Cowell. She loves animals, rescued owls in her front yard, and dotes on her two cats, dog and fish. The fish is named Wolf, after another of her favorite animals. To stay up to date with latest top stories, make sure to subscribe to this YouTube channel by clicking the button above this video. Horses are just so sweet, and I think that I have a real connection with them. I love riding them, and wolves are just so majestic and beautiful, she explained. Layla Cowell says she reads to animals at the shelter about three times a month. Layla is also delighted by the adoptable pets she meets over Zoom calls with Peggy Adams Animal Rescue League S Literacy Program for Children. She has read to different adoptable pets more than two dozen times in the last year. I do it about three times a month. I wish I could do it more, she said. Layla always picks animal stories to read to the dogs and cats. On this particular day, education manager Shelley Calmore set up the Zoom call to link Cowell with cats Lenny and Squiggy. The felines were sitting curled up and cuddling in a box in a room of adoptable cats. Shelley Calmore pairs children with adoptable animals for the reading sessions. It helps calm the cats and dogs, Layla explained. Calmore said her presence in the room and the sound of children reading helps to draw the pets out socially, making them more adoptable. They don't really socialize well, but when I read to them, they allow Miss Shelley to pet them, or they go to sleep, or they are less skittish, Layla said. The program also benefits her reading skills. I know a lot more words, my vocabulary is much better, Layla said. The We're All Ears virtual reading program at Peggy Adams Animal Rescue League has opened slots for virtual and in-person read-aloud sessions for children.